What's up, YouTube? Welcome to the Drip Mob. Push that button and say subscribe. Don't forget to leave a like at the end of the video. You feel me? All right, so this is my first time ever doing something like this. I never, ever did a um, story time, you feel me? But uh, at the time making this video, this video won't be released for probably months to come. At least a month, two, three months. All right, but anyway, we're going to talk about my first time uh, being, you know, in jail. Juvie. Placement. Detention center, you know, whatever you want to call it, you feel me? All right, so I'm not really gonna go into what happened for me getting the case, you know what I'm saying? Like, I don't know what I did or nothing like that, but I did get arrested for something before, so I don't know about that, John. That could probably be another third time because it's a whole different case. Yeah, I mess up with the law a lot, <laughs> you feel me? <laughs> saying a five ten to this YouTube shit. I mean, I do the nice little shirt on, you know what I'm saying? I mean, but uh, yeah, so actually. I'll talk about that later, man. In fact, I got some stuff for y'all, but I'll talk about that later. Like, for the video. This is going to make sense. Like, oh, it's not, you know what I'm saying? But we're going on to that. Uh, anyway, so, first thing first, when I was actually, you know what I'm saying, getting, you know what I'm saying, process and all that, I knew I was going to be locked up for a long time. Like, I knew I was going away for probably months for it to come. I was going to court, leaving court, going to court, leaving court. I was going to court back and forth. Like, the court is like every three months. You know what I'm saying? They schedule like they were surprised that you had a court and they had scheduled an extra one for 50 months. So I know I was getting booked for a long time. I was basically like out on bail. You know what I'm saying? You feel me? Like, I ain't, I wasn't on bail, but I was out on bail basically. Like, I knew I was going to get booked. I could have chose to run, but I chose to go. You know what I'm saying? Because I just want the time over with. You know what I'm saying? Because you're going to have a warrant on you if you don't go. And, yeah, you got to live in, you know, uh, fear. You know, not really fair, but listen, my mom's was not letting me stay at her crib with a warrant. So I live with my mom's, you know what I'm saying, at the time. So, you know, she was not letting me stay at the crib with a warrant. You know what I mean? So I was going to be fucking homeless. You feel me? I was only 16, you know what I'm saying, at the time. So keep that in mind. But, you know what I'm saying? So uh, anyway, so I went there. So I knew how they was told me, uh, you got to get booked March 3rd. All right, all right, all right. We got a place for you. We can send you up there, John. I'm like, all right. So, you know what I'm saying? You know, I, I show up there, whatever, whatever, in the courthouse. You know what I'm saying? I'm all, snap, I'm all scared and all that bitch. I ain't going to cap. I'm scared. Like, all right, man. You know what I'm saying? I'm a little nervous. Not really scared, a little nervous. Uh, like I tell you, so, <laughs> so I'm with this dude. So, so I'm with the people that's going to take us there, right? So I'm just sitting in the lobby, John. Not the lobby, but like the courthouse. It's like different floors of a courthouse. And I was sitting on one of the, the, the floors. And I was waiting for the dudes because. Cause it was I was the only person going up there. It was some other dude going up there, and then there was somebody there for court. So he was coming back with us. So he was already he was already sent up there. I, I'm gonna call it this, right? I'm gonna call it the junior. You feel me? It was called George Junior. I probably Google it. All right, so it was we call it the junior for short. You know what I'm saying? So so he was already at the junior. Keep this in mind. This is what the jail called the junior. Keep that in mind in the video. All right, so he was at the junior already, but he was coming. He came to Philly for court. You feel me? So he's because he's from Philly, so he's Philly judge. I live in Philly, by the way, so I'm from Philly. I mean, hey, they have in Philly, but uh, so he came from George Jr. To, to Philly, you know what I'm saying? So we was waiting for him to get out of court so we could go back. So it was me, him, and uh, some other dude, and then so we was driving to where we needed to go, the placement, uh, the jail, the juvenile, you know what I'm saying? Whatever you want to call it, you feel me? Just going up there. So uh, before we got there, we had to stop at Vision Quest now. Vision Quest is a detention center. You're not there forever. You're just there for um, a limited time. It's kind of, it's like, you only there. Now, people do do our beds there, but it's usually people there just for, like, holding. It's kind of like a hold. It's not like a holding cell. It's like, you there for, you might be there for, like, a month, two months to a jail or, you know what I'm saying, a place that's open for you, and then you get sent there. You know what I'm saying? It's like, you there for a little bit, and then, you know what I'm saying, you go to your your jail or whatever, whatever you know what I'm saying. But so we went to go pick up some other dude, and then we went on our way. So ride like six hours. I live in Philadelphia. We went to a place called Grove City. Never heard of it. You know what I'm saying? I was there. You probably never heard of it either. If you're from Grove City, if you're from Grove City, rush, 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 hit me up, though. If you really from Grove City, hit me up, cause I, I, I'm saying it was nice in Grove City, man. Like I wasn't really there because I was booked. You know what I'm saying? So I was always inside, but it <laughs> said. It's nice driving around with me, man. But anyway, so we get sent up, so I'm up to join. <clears throat> now, uh, but when we going up there, right, it was like, you know, like seven hours, you know what I'm saying? So the dude told me, this is why I never forget this dog. Uh, 
I'm not gonna say his name. I'm gonna just call him R. You know what I'm saying? Uh, a lot of people say people names, and I'm just not going on with it. I mean, let's so like, so I'm gonna call him R. So R was like, he was like, he was like, whatever you. This this, this is the you know, R is the dude that was already at the junior. He just came to Philly to go to court. He was already at the junior. So R told me, he said, whatever you do to get sent up here, you're gonna wish you never did it. I was like, whoa. And and this is the crazy thing. I remember he was so excited. He was like, I'm about to go home. I'm about to go home. He's like, yeah, I got discharge date. I'm like, when? He talking about three months from now. I'm like, you were brought at the time. I'm like, damn, three months, bro. That ain't that's not close, dog. You got a grip on, you know what I'm saying? Y'all know what a grip on is? It's a long time. It's a grip. That's it's just a long word for grip on. A uh, shorter word for grip on, but we say grip on. But it's just a, it just mean like a long time. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so I was like, I'm like, yo, bro. That's, <laughs> I'm like three months. You tripping? That's not close. I'm, I'm thinking in my head like. Bro, you excited about you getting released from three months from now? Shit, bro, you tripping, dog. This is a long time for you not going home soon. But you know what I'm saying? When you up there for so long, and you try to come home in three months, then no snap. And I guess that is good news, you know what I'm saying? But I'm like, at the time, I'm like, yo, dude. <laughs> when he told me, whatever you did to get sent up here, you're going to wish you never did. I'm just like, I was like, cold, scary cat, scary cat. Like, I was on some nut stuff. I'm like, Oh my God! Damn, you say something like that. I'm like, whoa, what the? You know what I'm saying? So you know, we get sent up. To, so we up the place now. It's seven hours away from Philly. So we up there, John. It's in Pennsylvania, but it's real, real close to Cleveland, Ohio. You know what I'm saying Ohio, Cleveland, same thing. Well, it's not the same thing, but it's closer to Cleveland. But it's closer to the Cleveland part of Ohio. You know what I'm saying, but you know how it's, it's close to Pittsburgh too. You know what I'm saying? Cause I mean, well, if you know how Pennsylvania look, nah, man. All right, anyway, so we had to jump. All right, so I went to a, a, a orientation. This, now the thing is, it's called cottages. Now cottages is like units. You feel me? But they call it a cottage. It's a cottage, but it's just like units. You know what I'm saying so. So it's but I went to a cottage. But them dudes, two dudes I was with, uh, not the not our the other two dudes who got sent up there too. Uh, do we got from the quest and the other dude that was at the courthouse? They went to special needs. Now, special needs don't mean you special or nothing like that. It is it's th like 18 different special needs. Now, I think probably only like like four and six are actually for special people, but the rest they just they like special. They need special needs, like not like they slizz, but like they super bad. You know what I'm saying it's kind of like a minimum, maximum security thingy. So I was like a minimum. You know what I'm saying, but they was like a max. You know what I'm saying because they it was like way stricter for them. And it was way not stricter for me. You know what I'm saying? But it's also this thing called ISU. Now, ISU is 23 and 1. If you don't know what that is, it's basically you in the room for 23 hours out the day. And you only out for an hour. Um, I've never been there, but I've been to CIU. And that's something else I'm going to talk about later. You know what I'm saying? So get better with me. So, anyway, so that's what ISU is. It's like you only, what do you only get there if you kill somebody? You kill somebody, rape somebody, but you can go down. So if you if you if you might be at ISU and then go to special needs and then go to a cottage, you know what I'm saying you can you can go down too, or you can go up. Is it or I'm saying how depend how you behave, but you're not gonna go down real quick, especially if you kill somebody. You know what I'm saying you're not going down quick. You know what I'm saying you probably had to be there for a couple of years or something like that before you can actually go down to a different. Uh, you know what I'm saying the security thing. So anyway. I meant cottage now, uh, orientation now. Orientation, you were there for 30 days, you feel me? Now, keep in mind, I was, I was 16 when I got booked, so it's school. We had school. Again, it's not real school. It's school, but it's not like a, a school of regular kids. It's school with everybody who booked, everybody who locked up. It's all of us, school. You know what I'm saying? So, um, I'm in, but I'm in orientation, right? So, I get there at 10 o'clock. And I'm in the room by myself. So I, I, I come to John's, you know, uh, you know what I'm saying? I get the little, they give me the little slides and all that, you know what I'm saying? Do I got them somewhere? Hold on. Hold on, quick. <laughs> I got him. <laughs> I got him. All right, so these joints right here, these are called the Bob Barkers, you feel me? These joints are the Bob Barkers, you know what I'm saying? These see-through joints, 
Jones a little dirty. I ain't where the Jones he is. <laughs> I don't know if y'all can say that Jones. You can't see it. It's a Bob Barker on it. Yeah, these is the Jones that they give you up that time. This Jones ripped on me when I came home. Know what I'm saying, but yeah, <laughs> these are the type Jones you get up there, bro. You see what I'm saying? And they got the other kind that you probably see in pictures, but like people in jail. You you know the uh, I don't know if y'all ever seen people in jail, but y'all see the other kind of slides where it's like, it's like, it's like, it's like I can't even explain the color. It's kind of like beige or like brown. You know, kind of slides. They got them kind of slides too. Uh, but I was giving those. They they kind of switched it. Like those were the old ones that everybody else be seeing. You might see in jail pictures. Those were like the new ones. You know what I'm saying? So that's why I ain't had those ones, but. <sighs> Anyway, so I get the slides, whatever those Jones are saying. Those are the exact ones. Um, yeah, so by the way, I did nine months. So nine months of that joint. But I give me the slides, whatever. So I'm in the room uh, by myself. And no cat, oh my God. I'm crying. Like, I'm really crying. I'm like, bro, what did I get myself into? I have no f date for my release. It's whatever the judge say. Because again, I'm a juvenile. So it ain't no, you come home two years, three years. No, whatever the, the judge said. But. But that being said, depending on what you do, you might not go home fast. If you get a gun charge, you up there for like at least a year, two years, you know what I'm saying? Like you live up there for like a minimum, like a year and a half, two years probably, you get a gun charge. You is, you know what I'm saying? But yeah, you really just got you really got a minimum. Minimum is really like five months for anybody. Five months minimum. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But depending on what you do, then that's that determines your minimum too. You know what I'm saying? But again, it depends on your judge if your judge wanna release you. Cause your judge is the kid, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Uh, anyway, but I'm really crying myself to sleep. I'm not crying myself to sleep. I'm really crying. I ain't gonna care. I'm like, oh man, what I get myself into, bro? I ain't going home. Like, I can't get my phone no more. Cause I ain't got no phone now yet. I ain't got no phone. I ain't got this. I'm like, I'm devastated, bro. I'm like, yo, what did I get myself into, dog? So anyway, fast forward the next day. I'm like, ooh, I'm scared. I'm like, I ain't scared. I walk out the gym. I'm like. Oof, man, it's all check out for breakfast. So I go out for breakfast, whatever. It's <laughs> getting scary, dog. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. It's like the way they do things up there is like, uh, like a drag like the army or something. Like, not an army, but like the way they call people. Like, like they have like tell you do your hygiene, then they tell you, you know what I'm saying? Shower. They call you for shower, they call you for hygiene. And shit like that. I don't know. That. I don't know. That's probably regular, right? But so, yeah, they call me, uh, they call me out for breakfast. So I eat my breakfast, whatever. And hey, I'm the new dude right now. Everybody, and again, I'm in orientation. So everybody there for 30 days, then you leave. So everybody I'm with, they knew too. Nobody old. Everybody knew too. Uh, so I'm with them dudes. And they like, so they was like, yo, where you from? I'm like, yeah, I'm from Southwest. At the time I used to claim Southwest. I claim West Philly now. Because listen, I ain't going to talk about it. Ain't a part, ain't a part of the story. If y'all want to know that, yes, I probably don't. I'll tell y'all. But yeah, that's tell me comment section below. They said tell me on that. So I'm, I'm with them dudes, right? And I'm like, yo, what's up, man? So they're like, where you from? I'm like, Southwest. I'm like, oh, I'm from Southwest. We only put some Southwest in this joint. All right, best. What's up, boy? Like, I'm from North. I'm from South Philly. I'm from Boom Boom. boom. All right, what's up, what's up, what's up, what's up, what's up, man? We all from Philly for real, for real. I think we all was from Philly. Yeah. Really enough, it's two different uh, orientations too. It's one called Patterson and one called Eden. I was in Patterson. That's like the best one too. It's sweet there. Eden be strong. You see, I'm in Patterson. It's sweet. It's sweet like candy. You don't know what sweet mean? It's like soft. It's easy. You can do whatever you want. Not whatever you want. But so anyway, I'm in that joint. Um, I got to talk too much about my experience. I'm really having flashbacks about it now. I I ain't think about this in years, but. Uh, yeah, so you know what I'm saying? I, I, I do my time, whatever, whatever, whatever. I get more adjusted to them. Uh, first, you don't really go to school the first week. Where well, first week you go to a rotation school where you get to learn everything and you do tests and stuff to put, determine what, what classes to put you in, how smart you is, you know what I'm saying? Like, all that. But like, and all that. So, you know what I'm saying? I'm about to do that. I do all that stuff and, I mean, I get I get into a class. I get, so, next week I'm in the school. You know, school is the regular school. But we get drove into school. Uh... Yeah, everybody else walked to school. And again, it's like a campus, bro. But it's like a locked out campus. It's not like college, not like that. Nah, it's not like college. Uh, but we get drove into school because we, since we knew it, we more flight risk. You know what I'm saying. So I'm in. I get drove in that Jones good school. I do my stuff. Cool. After thirty years, I get sent to a cottage called Cottage C. Uh, cottage C. I was there for a week. Uh, that's what we now. That's what we talk about. See, I I was there for a week. It was cool. It was sweet. Nobody in there was tough. Nobody in there was bad. Everybody was in there was like cool. They sent me 
a, a situation happened at another cottage, my unit director. Now, unit director is controlled a cottages. He controlled a certain amount of cottages. So he had a problem in something called, uh, what was my cottage called? Wedding. So he replaced, He since I was new, he switched me out with the dude and Wedding. Because the, the, the dude with and Wedding had a problem with the staff. So they switched me out with him. At the time, I go to Wedding. All these dudes is tough. A lot of them from, I think all of them was from Philly too. Um, oh yeah, by the way, the people from everywhere. New York, Pittsburgh, Island Town, Pinocchio's, well, I say uh, California, um, Chicago. I had people all around from that zone. It's really just like Pennsylvania, like it was like Pittsburgh. People from Cleveland. I mean, people were from California, Chicago, but I don't think they was. I don't think they got locked up in Chicago. I think they were just from Chicago. I don't know. But people, you do get sent from from uh, California. You catch a flight to get here, to get there. So yeah, they do. They do send you all the way across state. You know what I'm saying? They do. So uh, yeah. But anyway, so I'm I'm at the joint, whatever, whatever. I'm gonna try to make this video shorter. I'm gonna try to make this like 25 minutes because I'm six, 16 minutes right now. So I'm at the joint. Uh, what am I talking about now? Yeah, so they switched me, right? When I get there, it was all hard body people. They all from the hood. They all things tatted. They all tatted up. And I'm like, oh my God, I don't want to do with this. Because I'm trying to just do my stay and come home. At the time, I'm only there for like a month and a half. A month and a week. Because remember, I did the 30 days and I was at the cottage for one week. And then they transferred me. So I'm at, the, I'm at wedding. All hard body boys. I'm like, oh my God. So I'm nothing. I'm like, I, 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 uh, I say, uh. Uh, I'm like, no, I don't want to be here. So they sent me to CIU. Now, CIU is where you get if you commit suicide, try to commit suicide, you fight, you do anything bad, you know what I'm saying? You get sent that job. So I'm in there for security purposes, safety. I don't know what it's called. I forgot what it's called. But anyway, yeah, so I'm in there. And that job is the worst. It's 23 and 1. You get 15 minutes for lunch. You get 15 minutes for breakfast. You get 15 minutes for dinner. You get 15 minutes for a shower. And then in that 23 hours, you in there by yourself. With a bed and a little bit of room to do some push ups. That's it. That's it. That's it. You don't want to be there, bro. Now, a lot of people told me they sleep there. Like, they just, they just be sleeping all day, letting the days go by. But I had a problem sleeping. Like, I only could sleep for like probably 10 hours a day. Like, right now, I only sleep for like 10 hours a day. I just I can't sleep no more. Like, I just can't sleep. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. I don't even like sleeping for real, for real. So, I can't sleep. After 10 hours, I just. I'm gonna just lay down with my eyes closed. It's not gonna work. So I, I'm up there 13 hours. You know what I'm saying? Doing nothing for, for just looking at the wall. I'm looking at the wall. <laughs> I'm saying looking at the floor. Both talking about do push up. The staff talking about do push ups. No, and everybody, all the staff up there is different staff from the cottages. The staff up CIU, is staff for Crisis Intervention Unit. Um, the staff up CIU, they all got. Crazy background. This is all mostly dudes. It's one girl, but she was like real big. She was like, I don't know, she was army or something like that. She was like, something like that. She was like so mean. Though. I don't know, sure he's mean as shit. Uh, you know what I'm saying, but everybody else up there, they got like dude. The dudes got like UFC backgrounds, uh, UFC backgrounds, army backgrounds, all that stuff. They all trained, and they will mess you up real, real bad. You know what I'm saying? So anyway, I'm up there for four days. You know what I'm saying, yeah. 23 hours, 4 days, doing nothing, doing nothing, that shit was horrible, it was, it was horrible, but it's better on school days, because when you got school, you don't actually go to school, but, because, you know what I'm saying, you book, I mean, it, I mean you don't even go to the, the other school, but you got like a tutor, basically, and they, and they, like, a couple of other people in there, you got, y'all go to this teacher, and they teach you the stuff you're supposed to learn, and it's like, simple, it's like, real cool, but, anyway, but that's only for like six hours out the day, or five. It's like it's shorter than the other time. So anyway, I'm there for four hours. I mean, I'm there for four days. I come back. Um, I'm like, all right, yo, you. I'm like, so my unit director come. He like, yo, you ready to go back to your cottage now? I'm like, all right. Cause remember, last time I didn't want to be at the cottage because it was it seemed it too hard, body. I'm like, I'm not going back there. I don't feel like getting no fights because all them dudes is hard. And they sent me back anyway. I'm like, dude was not. He was going to say he sent me to see you. And I was like, all right, this it was horrible for me. I was like, I can't do this no more. 23 hours in one. I ain't for me. I'm like, yo, he come get me like, hey, you ready or are you still arguing? I'm like, all right, man, take, get me out of here, man. Get me out of here, man. I'm done. I'm done. 
know what I'm saying? But while you there, you have to fill out a package too. It get, it get bigger and bigger. Every time you get sent there, you gotta fill out a packet. If it can like 20 pages, like 50 pages, 100 pages, 200 pages, every time you get sent there, you gotta fill out that package, you can't leave. You know what I'm saying? So I, I, I had to fill out a package at first, but I started messing up. I had to fill out a package. So I was only there for like safety reasons, but I started acting up because I was like super mad. That I was like, yo, this is on corny as shit. Oh, like, like I was 23 and one, but I was really stressing, going crazy. I, I'm like, yo, I try to leave my joint. <laughs> I try to leave the room and all that. A little slow joint. I'm, I'm like, I'm out this joint, dog. They go, yo, what you doing? Go back in the joint. Y'all young. I'm like, they start locking. They start uh, grabbing, <laughs> they grab me and all that. I'm like, yo, like, <laughs> so I start. I, so they're like, oh man, you, you, you was in here for your safety reasons, but now you in for a bad reason. So you got five the package. Now we train you different and all that. They already treat you. They treat you the same. You don't get no special treatment. Whatever you there for, they treat you the same as everybody else. But yeah. Anyway, four days I get sent out. I'm, I'm with everybody else in the cottage. Uh, and eventually I become cool with them. I like. I don't say I love those dudes, but to now I'm cool with all of those dudes. You see what I'm saying? They all my guys. You know what I'm saying. Uh, couple joints but oh yeah by the way when i got sent to reddick remember r from the beginning who told me whatever remember whatever you did to get in here you gonna wish you never did that ish he was in the cottage i'm like oh snap i go into the cottage i see r i'm like dog yo it's crazy i'm like oh man that's that you know whatever that you're saying i'm like yeah that's crazy but uh yeah so you know i spent my next eight months up that joint you know then it'll be released uh other than that just doing the time up there wasn't bad the food was you know what I'm saying? Sometimes it was old. Sometimes it was bad. I love that you could eat how much you wanted to. Like, they had make like 12. Like, to my, and every cottage is different. So, my cottage had 8 people. Some cottages got 10. Some cottages got 12. My cottage had 8 people. Small, John. You know what I'm saying? One of the smallest ones. Because 8 is the minimum. 12 is the max. Unless you want to needs or, you know what I'm saying, CIU, which isn't. You, you only get sent there. It's not learn to him, but if you want ISU, you actually get sent to ISU. It's more CIUs too, because a lot of people do bad stuff. It's like two different CIUs next to each other, though. But anyway, yeah, I mean, the food was good. Sometimes the food was not nah, so We had dessert like every day. We had every day for breakfast was cereal, every single day. But lunch was different sometimes, well, time different. Dinner was different time. Dinner was different, and then we had a uh, snack. Uh, a lot of times though it wasn't that bad up there. I mean it wasn't twenty three and one when you when you was in the cottage, but you never know. It might be twenty three or one. But it was never bad because you was in your cell drawing, but it was like in your room drawing. It wasn't CIU. Even if you was in there, it wasn't as bad because you got pencils and you got your pencils, your your, your paper, your books. I was writing raps up that joint. I was writing books up that joint. I was reading books up that joint. You would go to sleep in that joint. You can do whatever you want when you in your your room, but when you in that CIU, you it's really just a bed and a little piece of floor to do push-ups. Ain't no paper, ain't no books. <laughs> it's just you on that floor, like it's yeah, like it's yeah, and man, it sucks up that joint. So when I was at, and I had a roomie. You don't got a roomie up that joint. You can't talk. When I was in my room, man, see, I, you ain't a roomie. You can't talk. When I'm in my actual cottage, I had a roommate. My man's his name, Quill. He actually a ball player, 6'3". Uh, he might, I don't think he's making it to the A. No disrespect to him. I don't know. He might. I'm not going to say he's not. I don't, I don't pair his downfall. He, hopefully, he make it to the A. I just don't know. I, I, I ain't talked to Bull in years. <laughs> I ain't talked to Bull in years, dog. So, yeah. I did follow him on Instagram and I came home. He followed me back. I don't know if it was Instagram. I don't know if he blocked me. He gave his picture to somebody else. I don't see him on Instagram no more, though. So, I don't know what happened to his Instagram, but... Yeah, that's pretty much it, dog. Uh, uh, again, I did my nine months. I met people. Everybody left. Again, like, remember the dude so I said he had three months? But I, by the time I got there, he had two months left. He left. Somebody else left. More people came. He left. By the time I left, nobody was there when I came. Everybody was gone. You know what I'm saying? Everybody was gone when I came. In that cottage, everybody was gone. Not the whole jail, no. People were still there. But when I came home, when I, my last day there, Everybody was gone, but my first day, my, 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 but my first, like, my fourth day there, somebody else came, that's the ball player, Quill, my roommate, you know what I'm saying, he came, and he was with me the last time, he was there, he did like 12 months to a year, he was actually at Glen Mills, that's another place, it was way worse, he was on probation, uh, he came home from Glen Mills off, on probation, then he violated probation, <laughs> then he got sent to where I was at, you know what I'm saying, and he didn't do with us and all that. 
Uh, I got to a lot of problems up there. I don't really make the videos so long. I got to a couple of fights. You know what I'm saying? Oh yeah, up this thing is and up there. It's called it's this thing called Home Pass. Now Home Pass is like you get to go home for a couple of days, like two days. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, it's sweet, right? Nice, right? Uh, but when you come back, you gotta get cavity search. You know what cavity search is? You gotta strip naked. You know, bend down. You know, you know, spread your cheeks and cough. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that shit uncomfortable as fuck. But it wasn't that bad. Actually, when I first, no, I was thinking about, like, oh my god, I got your cavity search. It wasn't that bad. Like, I mean, I won't say bad. Like, I, like on some stuff. It, it wasn't like, like I, 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 I was, I was comfortable doing it. But it wasn't like, oh my god, I did it. You know what I'm saying? Do it real quick. You know what I'm saying? You, just, <coughs> you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? You did it doing that real quick. It wasn't too bad. But uh, yeah. Anyway, yeah, I got to a couple of fights. You know what I'm saying? Not really know a couple. Of fights. I ain't really into no real fights. I just slap people around sometimes. I don't make the video too long. I got so much to say about it, man. See, I'm trying to tell you the whole experience. Uh, yeah, man. So, I'll probably do a part two to this, actually. Let me know if you want a part two in the comment section below. I'm going to holler at you guys in the next one. Uh, yeah, next part, I'll just be talking about what really happened between that eight-month span. I already explained what happened the first month, but I'll talk about my fights and people I fought, uh, the problems I had. Uh, there's, there's not really to talk about though. It's probably like five more minutes actually, but I don't make the video thirty minutes long, so I'm gonna highlight y'all in the next one. Make sure y'all subscribe to YouTube channel. I'll be doing more story times, but when I got arrested for the first time, just not me getting arrested, it's me getting locked up. So I'll do one when I got arrested for the first time. I'll do one when I lost my virginity. Uh, all that stuff, you know what I'm saying? All that stuff. So let me know in the comments below. Let me know in the comments below ideas y'all got me to do it. Q and A's, you know what I'm saying? Q and A's, you know, I was story times, ideas, give me all that stuff. Anything you want, let me know in the comments below. I'll do it. I'm usually a 2K YouTuber, but I'm expanding myself. You know what I'm saying? You can't be boxed into a corner. There's only so many people who watch 2K videos. So I'm expanding myself to get to meet new people. You know what I'm saying? A bigger variety. I know this video is super long, but if you watch it to the end, I really appreciate you, man. That's from the heart. One. Love. I'm out. Thanks for watching. Oh, snap, ain't in. <laughs> yeah, good looking out there. Wow. <laughs>